class. Before we proceed to our topic, let's check first your attendance. May I know who is absent today? Okay, man. So very good. Before we start our discussion, let's have first an activity. I have here the parts of endocrine system and you have to match the definition that I have given to you. So, so, so now paste it on the board. Okay, very good. It's all correct. Let's start our discussion. So, endocrine system is the collection of glands that produce hormones that regulate metabolism, drug and development, tissue function, sexual function, reproduction, sleep, and mood, among other things. So, as you know, uh, endocrine system can do a lot in our body, uh, especially how it functions in almost every organ of our cells in the body. Okay, let's proceed to the parts of endocrine system. First, we have the here the pituitary gland. The major endocrine gland, a pea-sized body attached to the base of the brain. The pituitary is important in controlling growth and development, the functioning of the other endocrine our brain. Uh, it uses information it gets from brain and tell other glands what to do. Thyroid gland is located in the our neck. So at least it control our metabolism. Uh, pag hindi tayo mag-function kamayan, maapektuhan ng ating nga heart rate, ng pag-function sa ating heart rate. Dayon, ma maapektuhan ng ating nga pag-muscon, tapos makagain kita kang weight nga abnormally or pwede kita maghiwang abnormal gland. Also known as suprarenal glands that produce hormones that help regulate your metabolism, immune system, blood pressure, response to stress, and other essential functions. So, same with, same with the pituitary and thyroid gland, it is responsible for our uh, metabolism, regulate our uh, blood pressure, immune system. So next is the pancreas. This organ is part of your digestive and endocrine systems. It makes digestive enzymes that break down food. It also makes the hormones insulin and glucagon. This insulin and glucagon ensure that we have take the right amount of sugar in our bloodstream and cells. This ovary. In women, of course, these organs make estrogen and progesterone. These hormones help develop breast and puberty, regulate the menstrual cycle, and support the pregnancy. Next is the testes or testicles. Of course, it is in men that this does make testosterone. It helps them grow facial and body hair at puberty. It also tells the penis to grow larger and plays a role in making sperm. So, so the testes, <laughs> it helps men grow their facial and body hair at puberty stage. Sa body, um, ka na sa, it helps hormones develop breast and so, any question class? Okay, none. If none, uh, we will end our, topic, our discussion. Thank you for the cooperation and for your listening.